All right, I'm going to start this. The sooner I can get this over with, the better. I'm not, I'm not really, I'm not big on these, uh, big on the scary games, you know what I mean? He just watches and plays analog horror stuff. Oh, wow, yeah. Yeah, I like, I like the, the walkthrough games, you know, like the, what's the one, I'm, Life is Strange is kind of like one of those games where it's a choice based, you know, like this is kind of like, it's nice to kind of go along with the story. But yeah, I'm not usually one to do these, uh, these spooky games, but since it's Halloween, you gotta get in the spirit, right? Yeah, it is. It is spooky, especially when you're playing with, especially when you're playing with head with headphones, and it's like you know, it's loud, it's immersive. Choice base, nice. I'm I'm not human. Yeah, I have, a, I, have, I have so many games that I still need to play. I have one that, that Karaka gave me, too. Uh, my name is Noah. I'm a 28-year-old male from the Midwest. I have no idea why I'm setting this, but I hope my story can be a lesson. This happened to me when I was 18. But I remember this incident like yesterday as the trauma dictated a major part of my life. So that's the that's what I heard was that these these stories supposedly are based on true stories from Reddit. Or something like something along those lines. For a little background, my dad was a realtor and almost always became friends with his clients. One day he came home and pitched me a small job offer for the weekend. One of his old clients was going away for a few days and needed somebody he could trust to watch over his house. The man worked as a COO at a local media company. Dad told me the man would pay me 100 just to watch the house and do some basic chores. I accepted the offer as I had nothing interesting going on for the weekend. Besides, I thought I could use the time to get school work done. Plus, I wasn't picky where my pocket money came from. My dad drove me to the house. So I'm, I'm, I'm expecting this one and the fourth and fifth episode to have a little bit better graphics and a little bit more um, in immersion and involvement. The first one was very, very basic. I mean, it was nice. It was still, still had its spookiness to it, but... Alright, so we are in a... We are in a, uh... What the fuck? I'm stuck! Oh. Okay, so shift. Shift is now... Sprint. My vision's all blurry. The audio mixing in these are always extremely good too. I think, and that's that's what really makes it scary is the audio, in my opinion. Um, there's a Until Dawn, which I know is an older game. Nope, is an older game. Um, that's another choice based game as well that's more thriller horror based and I, they just did a remaster of that but it's like 60 bucks or some shit and it's kind of kind of crazy that they're asking for $60 for a, for a remake like that I can't go outside but I will be on WoW later on um, if you two are going to be on WoW um Obviously, the reset just happened, so there's LFR and um, mount hunting and all that fun stuff. Bro. This is not a normal laundry. Um, oh, that was an accident. Um, Troll, I know if you wanted, you you were wanting to do that one lever thing for the mount. I'm hopefully we if we can find some two more people to help out with that, that'd be great. I'm sure we'll be able to find somebody. We can make a make a quick group for it. Who's this guy? 
damage. Excuse me. Where did you put it? Uh, who are you? Where is the bleach? I need bleach. What even is this place? Who are you? I don't even know. I said I need bleach. Oh shit. Noah. Noah, nap time's over. We're here. We're here. You said you could do this. Wake up now. Wake up, Noah. Noah, wake up. Okay, so this is a bad dream. Noah, wake up. So we got our math notebook. You still thinking you can do this? How long did I dose for? I got this, Dad. Roy called and said the key should be under the fake rock. Got it. He said it's in the backyard. Okay. And like I said, keep the doors locked and don't open the door for anybody. I heard you the first time, Dad. Okay, now get your ass to work. I hope you know I'm only in it for the snacks. Uh, I wanted to try to maybe um, go in front of the car. In the other game, I was able to go in, or to. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. There are other reasons I could have died that night. Oh boy. All right, so it's said to go to the backyard. I hope there's no sprint. Like, it was a nice neighborhood. How do you get the key from the backyard? That's where I'm going. From a fake rock. There's a, there should be a dog here. Good dog, good home. I hope there's a dog. If there's a dog, I'm, it'll be, we'll be okay. Um. Oh, here's a here's a dog house. Where's the dog? <gasps> there it is. Let's go. Oh, look at the little doggy. You gonna follow me? Fake Rocky. No, come come with me. Bring the dog. I want to bring the dog in. Um, okay, so now we're inside here. We got snacks. She said I had to pee. Oh no, we ain't doing that. Um, do not disturb for any reason. All right, I'm gonna just go ahead and follow that. I really had to pee. Okay, well I'm trying to find the restroom, I guess. There's the front door. Alright, so I'm assuming the restroom is upstairs. They finally added a restroom into this game. Because they were like, oh wait a minute, our uh, our first house didn't exactly have a bathroom. Terrible aim. Uh, let's see what we got. 
That's a lot of messages. Uh, this school is full of assholes. Evelyn. Okay, I know you're right, but I don't think you're an asshole. I don't think you're either. Let me call you in a bit. Pick up. I wish you could come tonight. Me too. I'm trying to read. Hey, thanks for taking up the job, kid. I really appreciate you doing this. I'm sorry I had to leave early. Mr. Carson, my bad. It's Roy. Got this contact from Walter. Work is really getting the best of me here. Oh, no problem, Mr. Carson. Um, my pleasure, really. He's my dad. Okay. I wouldn't have asked for anyone if it wasn't for Zeke. Boy's been a little sick lately. Well, I'll take care of him in the house now that I'm here. You have nothing to worry about, Mr. Carson. Okay. Um, if your dad doesn't think you're a good kid, I don't even want to know what mine thinks about me. I just think I really disappointed him. Oh my god. You're a lifesaver kid. Speaking of him, I wanted to remind you it's his dinner time. If you could get him his dog food from the basement, sure. Okay, so Zeke is the Zeke is the is the dog. Okay. Not again, Noah. You have to stop beating yourself up about it. Wait, did that bitch call you again? I just can't help but still feel so stupid. It wasn't your fault, period. Anyways, you've got some making up to do here. The grudge next weekend, wink wink. 100%, 100%, wink wink. Aw, they're in love. This little baby. There's a cat. Two cats. I'm honestly jealous of Ava Raffle. I know, right? Just had the weirdest dream ever. Okay. So we need to get the... Go to the basement. Which was right here? Yeah, how do I get, how do I turn on a light? Is there a light? Dude, this guy won't stop texting me, man. Leave me alone, dude. Almost right, I apologize for those lights in the basement. You can grab the flashlight in the storage room upstairs, no problem. Bath and bedroom. Storage room. There, there we go. some breathing like snoring or something I hear snoring where the hell is the dog food this dog food that I'm supposed to be finding or something. Okay. Oh, 
it was the dog. She, like look at that. Even just the even just the dog snoring from above freaks me out, man. It's just not, not good. Here he comes. Come on, Zeke. You're a good boy. That was enough for Zeke. Good boy. Hey kid, heard your, heard from Walter, you're a computer whiz. I have a favor to ask. My computer has been acting weird lately and my whole security system is tied to it. Oh yeah, you got a whole security system set up here. What's up, Hoosier? Man, dude, this guy just won't leave me alone. Welcome back, Wired. It's good to see you. Have a lot of expensive equipment laying around. Don't want anything happening to it. Yeah, I understand. I'll just take a look at your computer. Thanks, kid. This guy needs to stop texting, dude. Text more than a angry female. Just kidding. All right. Can I take Zeke inside? I want to take Zeke inside. Dude. All right. So this says, uh, do not disturb for any reason. I'm assuming if we try to open it, it'll probably give us a little bit of a jump scare or something. So we're just not going to do that. Um. Let's go try to find the computer so we can fix that. It's a whole green screen setup. That's right, because he has like a media company. That's right, okay. Uh, there's the computer over there. Okay. How's every how is everybody's day though? You guys are, everyone have a good day? It was good, yeah. It was me and me and Luna did a really nice walk. I was happy to. That's the computer, right? Where else am I supposed to? Oh, so this is the do not disturb. Okay. Okay, that's good to know. Luna, is he still eating? Yeah, he's still eating. Maybe upstairs. Uh, don't want anything happening to it. Right, okay. You had a scare this morning? What what scare? Um
Is my name Carson? My name isn't Carson. I don't think so. No, Carson... Carson is the... This is the house that we're staying at. That we're, we're taking care of. Couldn't find the horses. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's a big issue. But you were able to... Able to find them, thankfully? Hopefully? I mean... Like it's hard to find. Is it hard to lose horses? They were just hiding. Mr. Carson's office looked like a good spot I could sit down to work at. This is not. I don't like this at all. Okay. Uh, I remember I was doing calculus that night. Yeah, but weren't we supposed to help him out? Oh, I forgot the password. A L A L Carson fifty-three eighty-seven. I feel like I'm playing Emily is away again. Behind the bushes, sneaky horsies. It says Carson on the flashlight. Oh yeah, that's that's probably Carson. Yeah, the last name. Yeah. Um. Okay, so I'm supposed to do something here. Free trial for a limited get ch your children catch colds, your computer catch viruses. Okay. Guide to being a better person. Talk and talk. Directed by Alec Carson. In this video, we will be recovering how to talk. Like what? Step one. Don't be rude. This guy is rude. Don't be like him. Being rude will discourage people from talking to you. Okay. I'm gonna be so rude. Sorry, it appears that something is wrong with the broadcast. In the meantime, enjoy some happy images. Oh boy. Aw, duh puppy. Step two, remain calm in any conversation. Like this guy with no eyes. Hello. Now, even though the, what he said was controversial, did you stay calm? The secret to being calm is to not let your feelings interfere with the conversation. Being calm makes you a better person. That's all we have for today. Brought to you by all these people. Alright. Okay. Uh, so we can't do that. We're trying. We we're supposed to help him out. Get full protection. Antivirus. Fix and clean your PC. Download now. How you doing, Nomi? Did you guys learn how to be a better person? Is this like the ring? After we watch this, we have seven days. I think we only have today. Perform full scan. Eye is itchy. Uh oh, it's not pink eye. I'm doing okay. I'm I'm not entirely stoked on spooky games, but you know we'll do it for the lulls. You're never supposed to trust those antivirus. I thought I thought uh, I thought what's it called was 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 good. Security threat Trojan horse high. Rainbow systems threat not remove remove this threat. All threats removed. Great. Awesome.
close. Close. Okay, there's that, I got that. Okay. Uh it's done. It was just some Trojan. I'd recommend you only download softwares from trusted websites. Tell that to my kid, but thanks. I'll drop you a nice tip when I get back. Thanks, dude. Stop texting me. Evelyn Cooper, who sent us this wonderful picture of kitties. Um, what was your dream about? Weird rem reminds me of cooking with Jeffrey on channel 10 last night. By the way, the rerun must be on right now. You gotta watch it with me. What? Wait, that place got a TV? Yeah, hold on. Okay, so there's security camera stuff here. That is obviously the basement. Here's the basement right here. We gotta be aware of our surroundings. I did have schoolwork to do, but I wasn't feeling it at this time. Okay. Why do we why do we get a notification of Roy there? On on that computer. It's not our computer. That's a little it's a little sus. Alright. It's the laundry room. I'm trying to remember where, remember where everything is. Okay, that's that room back there. Bedroom. Don't see anybody outside, that's good. Storage room. Bathroom. Bedroom. I really want I want Zeke to come inside to come in though with me. You finish your food yet, Zeke? Luna eats faster than Zeke. Alright, let's go find the TV. There's a TV. Hello. Welcome. Cooking Jeffrey. Cooking Jeffrey. Jeffrey. I'm Jeffrey. It's on. It's Are you watching cat cat food? Super and it's my favorite dish. This is like some uh, this is like some Adult Swim stuff. Listen to the sizzle. Jeffrey really just be Jeffrey sometimes. I will be preparing what's known as a piece of cardboard dipped in milk. <laughs> we will need a piece of cardboard, a glass, and some milk. To start, we pour the milk into the glass. Next, we dip the cardboard into the milk. Uh, also, I think you should. Oh my god, I think you should get the groceries before it gets too dark outside. There's some cash in my nightstand. Groceries. I'm on it. Wait, what? We can finally serve it. This looks amazing. Time to eat! Cat chat. Okay, so there's some cash in my nightstand. I'm the hand merchant. I'm the hand merchant. I'll give you hands. Huh. Too many hands to handle? Alright, so we need to find his nightstand, right? So I'm assuming it's up here. I'm 
amazing hands. Uh, where's the money? Wait, what? Where's the money? Oh, there we go. Money. Cash. I got the best hands. You guys have the best hands? I have the best hands. For your trouble, get something for yourself as well. It's on the house. Thank you. Okay. Um, go. You should get groceries before it gets too dark outside. Okay. So. You can take Alex's bike. It's outside the garage. Okay. This is definitely a huge improvement from like the first two games, I think. Um, is there a map? I don't know where to go. Don't run into the cars, Vince. This is supposed to be a one hour game. I don't think we're going to do it in one hour, to be honest. So I apologize. If you, if you guys see something that I don't see that will push the game forward, let me know. I do not care about backseat gaming. Help me finish this as fast as possible. Hi. Doing good, doing good. Use a shopping basket. Okay. It's 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 kind of like a it's what's well, a horror game, know me? So there's gonna be like some stuff we have to find and some maybe like a little how about riddle not riddles but like um what's the word? Um, puzzles and stuff like that. Uh, speak of the devil, Turner and Andy. What are you guys doing here, bro? Your girl was here. She just left. My girl. What was her name? Kara or something? Dude, I said they're not dating anymore. Oh yeah, he hopped to that other chick so quick I didn't even realize. Don't listen to him, but dude, she bought tons and tons of cans. I think she's throwing like a party or something. You know about it, bro? She looks way older without the makeup. MILF energy, bro. You know, I think she's more of like a goth, goth MILF energy. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Anyway, dude, what are you up to tonight? House sitting for this guy. Just chilling? I'm gonna, I don't, I kinda don't wanna tell them what I'm doing. Just chill. Uh, oh, no, fuck it. You mean uh, Alex? He goes to the school with my sister. Heard kid's a real weirdo, especially since his parents split up. Whatever fills my pocket, I'm in for. Yeah, you guys have fun. Alright, dude. See you at school Monday then. See you around. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Alright. What is baked beans? Do we need any beans? No, we need milk and eggs, chocolate, and strawberry. Hi, how's it going, lady? He was also. Hey, son, do you work here? I'm just here shopping. Oh, okay, son. What is it? My son likes mustard. I came here looking for it. Uh, but I can't find it for the life of me. Do you know where it is? Uh, hold on. Let me get it for you. Oh, how nice of you. I'll be right over there. Let's find her some... Let's find her some... So we got milk. And we need eggs. Uh, we need mustard for this lady. Where's the mustard for the lady? Oh, here's the mustard lady. Is this the mustard lady? That's curry sauce. I ate mustard. Here's mustard. Uh, hey, lady. I just I 
Yeah, that's the one I'm getting. I'm giving it to you, dude. Shit, man. Just take take the take the mustard. Ketchup, strawberry jam, right? Strawberry jam, strawberry jelly. Uh, ketchup. Don't forget milk and eggs. Okay, we need to find the eggs. Uh, orange juice or some beer. Cool. Fucking selling Gatorade or Prime or something. Dog food? Do we need dog food? No, we need chocolate. Chocolate spread for Andy. So we need to get that Nutella. We need the Nutella spread for Andy. Um. Excuse me. Ran. We need ranch garden peas. What the hell are garden peas? Clean dish, rice. Do we need rice? No. Garden peas. Get honey. Oh, here's Uncle Tony's rice. Uncle Tony's rice. Stop. Hi, how's it going? I'm not talking to you, lady. I'm sorry. I just really don't need to add any more eggs. Okay, so we got strawberry jelly, chocolate spread, milk, and eggs. We need. We got the rice, we got the ketchup. Blah, so we need to get the honey, and we need to get garden peas and the ranch. Just, just too much stuff in here. Pat pat. I'm tripping. Where the heck are the garden? Where are the garden peas? See watermelon. Like, I imagine the garden peas would be here in the produce section. Oh, here we go. Garden peas. Garden peas. And we need ranch. Ranch. This is random, but no additional MSQ and WoW has come out yet. What is MSQ? What does that mean? So we got ranch, strawberry jelly, chocolate spread, milk and eggs, garden peas, get oh, we need honey, 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 honey. Where's the honey? Honey. Main story quest? Oh yeah, yeah, that's not gonna come out until the until for a while actually. Hey Yana, how are you doing? How was your stream yesterday? Did you have a good time? Did you get some wins on Dead by Daylight? Uh, I need honey. Where's my honey? This lady. Dude, take your damn mustard. It was okay. This is all ranch. There's the honey. We got it. Alright, cool. So I think that's everything. How's your stream going? It's going pretty good. We're doing this scary game. I'm not a big fan of scary games, but we're going to do it because we like to entertain. Um, okay, so we got ranch, strawberry jelly, chocolate spread, milk and eggs, garden peas, get honey, rice, Uncle Tony's only ketchup. Don't forget the milk and eggs. We got all that. That looks heavy, kid. Should I bill all that for you? Mr. Carson didn't leave enough money to buy extra stuff. Wait, what? Where's this old lady? Dude, take your damn... Did you find the mustard? What? No, I found the mustard, dude. Take the fucking mustard. It's right here. It's right here. It's right here. This mustard is right here. Here's the damn mustard. Take, take this, take the mustard. Could you get me one too? I already got... This stupid lady, dude. I got her the mustard. I want to find me a good scary game to do. There's a, I can give you some red. Honestly, Fierce of Fathom's pretty good. Yeah. 
All right, you know what? I'm sick of this. Is okay. So, oh my god! Just take, take, take all of this, man. This is ridiculous. Stupid mustard. Get what's this? Is this the mustard? It's that old lady. You should play Phasmophobia. I've, I've actually thought about it. Give mustard. Okay, there we go. Help the older lady. We helped the older lady. That took way too long. I'm gonna talk to this this chick. She didn't do nothing. She didn't do nothing for me. Oh yeah, because you uh, because you got party animals, man. You gave me the the gummy and all that stuff. You've been really cool. Love you too, Red. Thank you, dog. Thank you again, man. Thank you for the for the 420 bits. Um, we actually have quite a few people here that we're gonna give a shout out really quick. Um, if you guys. Could give me a uh, do me a favor. Can you guys follow uh, Big Red? We got uh, Yana in here. If you guys like um, Dead by Daylight, she does a lot of Dead by Daylight. Nomi is another streamer friend that we met recently. Does a lot of variety stuff as well. So I appreciate y'all. If you guys can all go give them a follow. We also have Rara in here, who's a fellow uh, Clone Hero WoW streamer. She's doing League of Legends right now. So if you guys can go follow each other, support each other, that would be great, and I'd appreciate that. What do you mean I didn't get all the items? What do you mean I didn't get all the items? I got ranch, right? What up, Icy? Thank you for the lurk, dude. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's milk. What is that? Mustard? What is this? This is ranch. This is ranch. Yeah, I've seen I've seen someone get pretty pretty pissed off at mustard. So we got we got the ranch, right? This is uh, let's put this right here. We got the ranch. That's one. Here's gold's ketchup. That's ketchup. Eggs. Uncle Tony's long grain rice. What is this? What is this? I don't need that. Let's get that out of here. Uh, honey. Strawberry jam. Chocolate spread. And milk. Right, so we need ranch. Oh, we got ranch. Strawberry jelly. Strawberry jelly. Chocolate spread. Chocolate spread. Milk and eggs. Here's the milk. Here's the eggs. Uh, garden peas. Oh, we didn't. Where's the peas? We just had the peas. It's right here. Peas. Here's the garden peas. Get honey. We got the honey. Right? We got the honey. Is that this? Yeah, that's the honey. Ketchup. Yeah, we got it. We got everything. Why? Why is he? peas? Honey. Strawberry. Milk. Spread. Rice. Eggs. And ranch. What's up, maps? I was still missing some things from Mr. What was I missing from the list? Give me some Choco ch Choco Cops. I'm so confused. What am I mi Am I tripping? Did I miss something? Am I am I am I tripping? Am I missing something? There's because there's the peas. The ketchup back. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Thank you, Red. There we go. Thank you, Red. I was like tripping out. I don't like this. Give this game a two out of three. Groceries are hard. I'd rather be scared than have to deal with these groceries again. When you think you do, but you don't. You gotta do a kickflip. Be aware of your surroundings. There's a there's a truck there.
Did I get hit by a, did I get hit by a car? Uh, I don't remember what house it is. I think it's... I had to pee again, and I was starting to feel a little hungry that time. Is this the house? That's not the house. No, that is. this is the house. Yeah, this is the house. So there is a dog inside, his name is Zeke. Apparently there's a kid. I wonder if the kid, this kid is gonna come back and like spook us and be like, hey, how's it going? We left the TV on, I don't know. Nope, not doing that. Nope, 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 we ain't dealing with that. these away or something? No. I kept groceries in the kitchen and he needs to pee. Thought I could get some schoolwork done now. Okay. Honestly, Red, these Fears to Fathom games are pretty cheap. I think you would I think you'd enjoy them. If you're trying to look for some scary games, I saw Cratylus play this and, and uh, it looked like it could be interesting. So, um I think the first episode is free. I think the first episode is free. Thank you, Mavs, for the lurk. Appreciate y'all. Make sure you wash your hands. And then you said get some school work done. We never texted back this girl. Dude, you said you're at Carson's, right? You need to see this. Search up Roy Carson divorce on the internet right now, Andy. Okay. Also, you guys could check out Maps as well. Maps is starting uh, streaming as well. I think you said he'll be on soon. Um, Roy Carson divorce. Roy Carson, co-founder of BN Media, claims to be receiving death threats from the angry fans of his ex-wife. Co-founder death threats after very public divorce from his actress wife, Alyssa Brown Carson. Interesting. Okay. All right. I did have schoolwork to do, but when I saw Andy's text, my curiosity got the better of me. Okay. I had to look it up. I did. I already looked it up. I'm ahead of the. I'm ahead of the curve here. Oh, we gotta click this. Okay. Roy Carson, co-founder of BN Media, allegedly receiving death threats from the angry fans of his ex-wife. So here's Roy. Here's his ex-wife and some lightning. Uh, Hunter News. It's not unusual for audience to be nosy about some of the celebrities' personal matters, but sometimes it's just too overbearing. We see something similar in the case of Roy Carson, the COO and co-founder of BN Media. After his very public breakup and divorce with his wife, former actress Alyssa Brown Carson has allegedly been receiving death threats from the fans of Alyssa Brown for the rumored infidelity that underwent within the said relationship. So apparently Roy cheated on Alyssa. Sources say Roy has had people knocking on his door to confront him. Alyssa hasn't been very vocal about the situation yet, but Hunter knew someone was at the front door. I was told not to... Uh, let's see if we can check this. Um, there's someone there.
Hmm. Should we answer the door? So I grabbed my gun and I took it to the guy in the front, shot him in the kneecaps. So I guess it would make sense that like her fan. Oh, it's raining outside now too. There's that guy's car. What a weirdo. Can I like why why am I not why am I not texting Roy right now and be like, yo, hey, you got someone outside. Can you do something about it? Hello. Hello. My name is Cora. Welcome to the Nostrock. They said not to answer the door, so I'm not going to answer for this guy that I do not know in a house that isn't mine with a lot of expensive equipment. Oh. Okay, so this is good to know. The laundry room is, is good to know that that's a hiding place. Last time we were in the motel, we had that, like, talking meter thing. If you talked, then they could hear you in there. So I'm gonna... Can I call the cops? Or something? Someone's at the front door. I couldn't have worked like that. Yeah, well, let's... Can we do something about this or something? Like... Can we call- what is- what's going on here? Can we call the cops? This guy's in the rain. He's got no jacket on. He's gonna get sick. It looks like he has a bag. Oh, you know what we- I- I, I have to answer- yeah, I was just gonna say, Wired, it's just like the other one. Like, at the motel, you, like, technically have to answer the door in order to progress the fucking story forward, which is really stupid. I was trying- I was trying to big brain it, and just let him maybe get tired, you know what I mean? Should I just open it? If I feel like if I open it, it's, I'm gonna have to start all over again, and I don't want to do the dang groceries again.
Yeah, I already talked to him, but I know if I open that door, it's gonna be an end. It's end game for me. I can't. Where's why is Zeke outside outside in the rain? Fuck, man. What what other what else am I supposed to do here? Open it and leave? I'm gonna open it and it's gonna be a jump scare. Wasn't even there. Is that a fucking gun? No, that's a pizza. That looks like he has a gun in his hand. Engrossment. Okay, so we did we did it. We did open the door. Kane on the the guy outside. I didn't even I didn't even look. It looked it looked like like he was holding a pizza box, but it looked like it could have been a like could have been holding a gun. Power went off. Of course it did at 1:36 in the morning. Unknown sender. Oh, now, now I get Roy Carson telling me, hey, look out for some pizzas. It should arrive any minute now. Enjoy. Yeah, thanks, dude. Totally, bro. What an idiot. Uh, hey, how are you? What did you have for dinner? Are you by yourself? Why do you keep ignoring me? Why are you always so mean to me? You're, you are being very immature right now. Fine, if you're going to be like that, I don't need you anyways. Todd is so much hotter anyways. So I'm assuming this is going to be um, her, his ex, his ex girlfriend or something like that. In that moment, I almost, I was almost certain that it had to be another prank by Turner. Oh, fuck me! Where where is the where is the uh What was it? Al Carson 5386 I think it was. No. Eighty seven, fifty three, eighty seven. Oh, look, it's back on. 
Ayo, Carson 5387. I saw someone. I saw someone walking right there. There is a there's something right here. It looks like a dead fish or something. Car was out, I couldn't continue my schoolwork like that. Okay, so. I can't see a damn thing. Where do I even go to turn the power on? The dog's barking. Where's Zeke? Turn the power back on. I could tell that someone had cut the power off from outside. It had to be Turner. He was really starting to piss me off now. Can I bring Zeke inside, please? Come on. Come on, come inside. Go inside. I need to find my flashlight though. You're gonna come in? No. Uh, you said we'd stay friends. Turner, this is not funny. I know it's you. But I, this, how is he? Why does he expect that to be Turner? Is it? Is it not his ex-girlfriend? Didn't they like just break up or something? I had to get back to my schoolwork for Monday. There was a... There was a flashlight in there earlier. I don't know why it's not there now. Strange gut feeling about the situation. 
It might sound stupid now, but I just didn't want to overthink things. There's something right there. I don't know what it is. I heard something. Yeah, that that wasn't on. If I had a heart monitor, it'd probably be at like 200 right now. There's a knife missing. <clears throat> and that door is open. That door's not supposed to be open. Loki, it made me very uncomfortable knowing he was in the house. I had to confront him? Confront who? He didn't have his contact. I could only ask Andy. Alright, well let me get in here first. This is I think this is my safe safe zone. The only logical the only logical thing I think I could think of at the time was to keep an eye on the security monitor. Right. That's thank God for this. I can kinda like see things from a bit away. Now that I think about it, I should call the cops. <sighs> that moment school work became okay, I should probably call the idea that came to my head. Doors open. I hear footsteps. Dude, he's at my place right now. We were gonna go to the movies, dude. Wait, did you check out that article? It was Brady who told me about it. Oh, this is real sketchy. Oh, God. Hold on, hold on. No, 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 no.
hate this so much. She was right outside the door to the room I was in. Wait, how did she know? How did she know I was in there? I didn't. I didn't even move. I didn't. I didn't. I'm kind of I'm confused as to okay hold on let's try it let's backtrack here for a little bit let's backtrack a little bit well we lost we just we just lost I'm trying to figure out what what's okay so she comes into the house she's going door to door right we watch her on the screen she ends up outside the she ends up outside of the outside of our room that we're in with the security camera when she when be we do the same. I wonder if we do the same thing, but do, instead of looking out the door, do we do we go more into the laundry room and then just try to stay as quiet as possible? It's a good thing that um, October only comes once a year. Because, uh, yeah, this, this is, uh, this sucks, but at least, at least we know, we know that it's his ex-girlfriend. Apparently my name is Noah. How did she know that we're here? Actually, I'm gonna keep this open. Should also keep this door open. Uh, yeah, my heart rate's going at about a uh, 500 beats per minute right now.
Gonna go make a taco. Let's go. I had a I had Taco Bell earlier today. Yeah, uh, be, uh, bean, bean and bean cheese rice burrito with sour cream and a uh, spicy potato taco. That's what I got. I remember Cradle is saying something about this one. I can't remember what he said. But I think he got stuck here. I heard he got stuck in some section in this game, in this episode too, if I'm not mistaken. Fuck, dude, this is closed. It's supposed to be closed. This girl's hell of fucking like just sloppy with her movements. I should be should be texting Roy and being like, "Yo, dude, can you call the cops and send someone to your house, man? Because there's someone messing with your house. Like, how do you not?" Okay, you know, at least we know we at least we know this. It's a, it's a it's a girl, bad guy, bad girl. Yeah, my heart skips a beat too. It's such a freaky thing. I
Is that it? I left the house and ran out of the block. I did. The Betty, I called the cops, though by the time they arrived, she had already left the house. But I knew where she lived. Kara was one of the first people I met on a dating site. She was three years older than me. Older than me, but I found her cute, so we started dating. However, two months into our relationship, she started doing hard drugs. I tried to get her help, but she turned it around on me as, as if I was trying to change her. One day I had enough and I had to break up with her. I told her to leave and never contact me again. She was pissed. She was trying to convince one of the cops she didn't intend on doing anything wrong that night. But of course the cop wasn't buying it. They reviewed the footage and it showed everything from the point of her entry to the moment she grabbed the kitchen knife. Right. But the thing that messed with me the most was the fact that, that nothing was stolen from the house. Turns out she was heavily under the influence of the drug and alcohol of the drug not a drug not and certain it just the drug and alcohol at the time she was arrested and sentenced for a long while that was a lot better than the, the second one that was that was a little bit easier to handle a little bit but I was still the uh, the 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 dude with the pizza got me. We only we only got spooked one time too. Not even really spooked, but we only got like one like jump scare moment. I'm actually a little bit surprised. I'm a little surprised they didn't integrate the basement a little bit more with her and like some of the other areas like the the um what's it called? The uh the media room and stuff like that but we got it yeah we got it 